Yes, so hello and welcome to another edition of Sports Update Ghana. My name is Joseph Adamafio and coming up in this edition, Ghana's under-17 side, popularly known as the Black Starlet, come up against Nigeria's under-17 side, also known as the Golden Eaglet, in the third place match of the ongoing Waffle Zombie under-17 football tournament. Ghana and Nigeria compete for the bronze medal in the Wafu tournament after missing out on the final. We're going to look at who is going to lead the Black Starlet out of the dugout as coach Lai Kinson is no more the head coach of the Black Starlet. We also look at Nigeria's performance so far at the Wafu tournament. The, we'll check out how you can watch this particular game from anywhere across the world so more updates coming up right here on sports update ghana in this preview please subscribe like share and don't forget to leave a comment so let's get into it so ghana's under 17 side popularly known as the black starlet after failing to qualify to the final of the waf under 17 football tournament come up against nigeria for the bronze medal in the third place finish of the tournament so let's get into the details for this match when is the match what time is the match and the venue for the match so the match comes off on tuesday which is today the 28th of may 2024 the time for the match is 16 hour gmt and 4 p.m local time in ghana 5 p.m for the time in nigeria that is the time for ghana's game against nigeria now the venue for the match is at the university of ghana stadium right here in accra ghana legon to be precise now the game is open to the public for free yes if you have in accra and you don't have anything doing us at 4 p.m local time you can go to the university of ghana stadium and watch the black starlets in action for the last time for free yes the match is for free now let's proceed and do more so following ghana's failure to beat Burkina Faso, Likens and announced his resignation as head coach of the Black Starlets and this became a big issue between the GFA and the uh, coach himself that is Likens and but we'll put that one aside and focus on this game. So the big issue is that the GFA says that a new coach is going to lead the Black Starlets out for this game against Nigeria. So who is the coach leading the Black Starlets out for this game against Nigeria? Well, the coach who has been assigned for this game is the assistant coach that is Nana Ajimai and he gets to lead the Black Stars Starlets out for the game against Nigeria. Now, let's look at how far the Black Starlets have come in this particular tournament. So the Black Starlets started the tournament with the first game against Cote d'Ivoire which we won by five goals to one then we came up against Benin where we beat them by two goals to zero to qualify out of the group as leaders with six points Ivory Coast in second place and Benin got evicted well the tournament is a seven nation tournament so there is three teams in group A four teams in group B that is why Ghana played only two games in the group stages and Nigeria played three matches now Ghana made it out of the group stages and we came up against Burkina Faso in the semi-final unfortunately Burkina Faso beat us and well they ended our hopes of qualifying for the U17 AFCON if we had qualified for the final so that is how come we are going to play against Nigeria now let's look at Nigeria's performance at the tournament so Nigeria started the tournament in the first match against Burkina Faso it ended goalless draw in that match their second game was against Togo and they beat Togo by one goal to zero in their third match they were with the same points as Burkina Faso, four points each. But after the final whistle, Nigeria beats Niger by three goals to zero, qualifying as group leaders with goal difference, which is above Burkina Faso. Although they both had the same points, Nigeria came up against Ivory Coast. Ivory Coast beat Nigeria in that particular encounter. So Ivory Coast and Burkina Faso make it to the final of the Waffle tournament, whilst Ghana and Nigeria make it to the third place and when you are in third place you only get to win the bronze medal you don't qualify for the u17 afcon so the francophones make it to the afcon but the anglophones are not going to the under 17 afcon so that is how the two sides have performed at this particular 
tournament. Now, Nigeria are the defending champions of the WAF Under 17 tournament after their stellar performance in Ivory Coast last year. Now, Ghana's Blast Talents held their final training session at the Accra Sports Stadium yesterday on Monday, and so today they are prepped up for the game and the same for Nigeria. And well, Ahead of this match, Ghana's coach Nana Ajiman has been speaking ahead of the game and speaking in an interview. This was what Nana Ajiman had to say. He said, the boys are poised for action. The boys know they have to give their all for the game so as to capture some silverware from this tournament hosted by Ghana. So the hope of Ghana's team is to win a medal and that is the bronze medal that they want to win at this year's under 17 Wafu tournament. So that is what the coach of Ghana's side has to say ahead of the game. Now let's wrap it all up with how you can watch the game from anywhere across the world. If you are outside Ghana and want to watch the game, well you can watch the game on YouTube and Facebook. That is where the game is going to be streamed. So if you are from anywhere or you are living in any part of the world, you can just go on YouTube, type Max TV and or Max FM and you can get to watch the game at exactly 16 hour GMT or better still on facebook or youtube just type ghana versus nigeria live wafum and the search engine will give you the live stream for you to watch the game but mind you right after the match the match highlight will be here on the channel for you to watch so yes the highlights will be on this channel for you to watch and so yes that's how we wrap up for this edition of sports updates can i hope i brought you all the updates you have to know ahead of this game let me know in the comment section who do you think is going to win this game ghana or nigeria you know how big it is whenever nigeria jollof meets ghana jollof well my name is joseph adamafio it's always a pleasure coming away with the sports update i'll see you in the next one i'm out drives it through into the 18 yard box the flag stays down opportunities coming the way of ghana chivano twisting and turning that's nabi Oh! Oh! What a goal! What a goal! Inch perfect cross. Artistic by all standards of that delivery. Hard work and congrats to uh, both Norte and Chivano who controlled it nicely. Turned the defense inside out. And then the delivery from Joseph Nabi. And the style. Looking up as well. Tension is to win most of the 50 50 balls, and they allow the player to go through them. Michael has been beaten again. It's a brace for Asharaf. A brace for Asharaf. Kapsoba.